I'm just here at Sheffer and I'm just about to have a look at Louisa Chirkoff's um, show and it's the last day so luckily I'm here. Hi Louisa. Hello. <laughs> mm. Are these collages? Yeah, they've got um, a little bit of um, photo montage in, in the work. So they're mixed media and they've got um, watercolour and gouache and Mm, that's the one for the invitation. And uh, they're more mindscapes, mental, mental landscapes of a series of disturbances. She says a lot, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Disturbed artists. Oh, no, that's good. I like that. Gives a bit of flavour to it. <laughs> Spice. So the, you've done watercolour and painting? In, yeah, in... yeah, they works on paper. Oh, this was the one in the paper? Yeah, that was the one that um, got critics' choice for the Metro. Yeah. I love the green. Yeah, I think a lot of my new work's moving in that direction. series on the Pieta, um, just playing on the idea of family, um, so you get Christ being substituted by a child and um, a lot of um, layered meaning in that one. I think I see that more as a body of work rather than just individual works. Oh yeah, yeah, it works like that. Yeah. And bicycle training. Did you ever come off your bike as a kid? Oh yeah, I did once. <laughs> yeah. I got back on quick. <laughs> you gotta do that, haven't you? You can't just stay off, you gotta That's get back right. on again. <laughs> I'll turn the engine off, will ya? <laughs> can't you see people in my sleep? It does actually. <laughs> this one here is, follows this. Yeah, a bit of an extension of the Pieta where the mother becomes um, a substitute for Christ in this image and the doll, the rag doll, it's called rag doll Pieta and um, the doll is um, an image of comfort but it's also flaccid and, and dead and it assumes the role of, of Christ so it's just a bit play, play on the idea. This is another good one. Yeah, this one's Bell. It's um, about focuses on relationships, so that embrace and the boating road that they're standing on with a, a knife of light coming in between them. Well, it's got a red spot on it too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and more montages. Yeah, photo yeah. montages. Got lots of those in here. Yeah, they? Oh, they help me work through ideas, and um, I just enjoy doing them. And it's I think so I kind of like this process to drawing and painting. And it's something that you know, in between drawing well, and painting for me, it does have a tendency yeah. to break up the paintings yeah. as well. Yeah, it does. And this one here is another <laughs> the pig, like a yeah. version so, where the Virgin Mary is actually replaced by a forest of trees. And um, it's been an interesting image, that one's had very responsive in the exhibition from both practicing Catholics and non-believers. <laughs> yeah, and didn't you say also that um, someone thought it was Klux Klan yeah, Forest? Yeah, Clan Forest, because it follows that surreal, it's got a very surreal edge to it. Yeah. And they almost take on mountains, so. Yeah, they do, they take on mountains, but they also take on a, a, like a human figure as well, yeah. especially through the camera. Yeah. Do you get music as well? As well? You get <laughs> you everything today. It's such a beautiful day, that's why. You have the champagne outfit. I know, I was expecting <laughs> some champagne. <laughs> this one here, can you tell me something about this um, one? It's coming out into, it's a little bit more of a, um, I think, autobiographical 
image and um, a lot of people comment about my work having uh, relevance to children and childlike images so I do kind of reference that but also it was a bit of a turning point for the got, this, this, this Is that a wing? Wings, yeah, yeah. Like, um, it's like entering like gates of heaven, it's um, like adornment so it just kind of touches base on a, a bit of my background and my heritage. Mm. You have a very interesting life, Louisa, <laughs> and a very interesting outlook on life. Dark. <laughs> it's, not, well, it's not really that. I mean, I love the greens that you bring into the work. Yeah, green. The green the represents place. calm. Oh right. That's why I like you. Yeah. yeah. So, people do get a bit. They get in a frenzy when they see me. Yeah. <laughs> like so I, I did. When I saw you. If I wear green, then it calms them down. That's what okay, kind it's green, isn't it? <laughs> That's right. Good <laughs> shit. That's right. Perfect. Yeah, so that's like a midnight walk. It's like, you know, the way um, we see life and how things change. And so if we look hard enough, the shapes in the landscape look different. Oh, yeah. And so, yeah, and we are bigger and we see things the older we get, our life experience. And is this you abseiling down? If his mother again. <laughs> trying to take, get a grasp on things, even though she feels like she's connected. Oh yeah, so more ragdoll legs. Yes, yeah, that's canal. It's where we all come from. This one's great, I love this one. Yeah. You look like you're wearing a kilt and you're, yeah. you're headless. Yeah. Yeah, when you think you're on top of things, you haven't quite got there. And I think that's what, um, having a little self-doubt in yourself is what helps drive you. It helps, um, I think I've got a lot of self-doubt when I do things and you get confidence and then you get self-doubt again. <laughs> yeah, nice little balance there. Yeah. Is his father um, trying to do his role? What trying is his to role? Collect, um, um, you know, trying to provide. There's a bit of light happening now, yeah, yeah. but that's oh, alright. That that's interesting, doesn't it? Yeah. Looking at it, Julie. That's the struggle. I think um, it's how I feel as an artist. Um, with a child. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes, of course. It must be hard work. It is. Balancing. And your head's kind of, you're there for them physically, but your head's not there. <laughs> but it's like, it would be a lot more difficult for you if you are single mum. Yeah, absolutely. Yep. Thank, thankfully, you're not. No. <laughs> but yeah, I, I do have a lot of respect for single mums who oh, are artists. It's a hard job. This, these are your heads. And these are the heads, the self portraits that are. This um, one here looks very sort of almost. Um, yeah, it's high. Yeah, it's got an ambiguous, ambiguous feeling to it. Um, it's clothed like a machine. And you've got Mona. Yeah, Mona. Mona's in there. She's got problems with her oh, eyesight. Well, she's, this time she's mysterious on the inside. Yes. And not on the outside. Yeah, I like to shift within genres like different subjects and things. And the last one is the baby. Oh yeah. Yeah, the baby. Yeah, just playing on the idea of This is what we started on. Yeah. Yeah, the hand, the ambiguity of the hand and the arm, and it's, um, once again, I like focusing on relationships in work as well. And that's it. It was wonderful dealing with you, Fleur. Oh, no, thank <laughs> you very much. And oh, I and, yeah. you've got Georgia Pengi on your shoulder. <laughs> mm. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.